Hey guys, what's going on? It's Anthony here today with another Final Cut Pro tutorial for you guys. And today I'm gonna be teaching you how to add text in Final Cut Pro X. It is very simple and it is something that you will master. So I thought text would look really good here in the beginning of my video project. After it's super fast and it slows down, I just think text would look really good there. So to get started with adding text, you wanna to go to the top here where you're gonna see the add text or generators tool i'm sorry and generators tool inside of there you're going to see titles and you're going to see generators titles is going to be your text so 3d is going to be your basic text it's just like a basic 3d look custom 3d is nothing at all basic 3d has this like pop out effect to it it looks kind of cheesy so let's drag custom 3d and when we drag custom 3d into our timeline here we're going to notice that we can overlay it on top of our clip of choice or we can go to the beginning here and drop it as its own individual clip in the timeline and it'll just have a black background but for the sake of this video we're going to overlay it onto the video clip and we're just simply going to press on it and double click on it. And what that will allow us to do is edit what it says. So you can either edit part of it by clicking and dragging or drag to select all of it and then type in what you want. So we're going to type in Sentinel Park Tucson AZ. So I'm going to select this text here and we're going to go up to our levels tool or inspector is what it's actually called. And inside of the inspector, we're going to go all the way to the left here where it shows this T. It might already be selected for you. And in there, we'll be able to decide I'm sorry, not in the T, in the lines here, we'll be able to decide what its size is. So we're gonna make it a little bit smaller and we can even decide things like line spacing, which does nothing in this case, tracking, which will decide how far apart each letter is or how close together they are. I kind of like it a little bit spaced out like that. We can also choose font. My favorite font to use is called Blair. And we can also choose the color. So let's make it like a reddish orange. So now that we have made our text, you might want to move it around and put it in a different spot. That is something that you can do easily with the transform tool. We actually are already selected on the transform tool. If you're not, you just wanna select the title or whatever you're trying to transform. And then you're gonna to wanna to go to the box with the line in it and hit on transform. Now what we can do is move this around inside of our space here can make it smaller like this as well and I'm gonna have it be centered right at the top here right in the clouds and to go the extra mile you can go to the transition tool you can add a transition to your text so to just make it basic and to make it look good I'm just gonna go with cross dissolve and if we drop it right in the center well, it's not doing it for me right now. Oh, yes, it did actually. It'll actually put a transition on the beginning and end of this clip. So let's check this out and see how it looks. Awesome. So guys, that is how you add text to your project in Final Cut Pro. If there's anything else you need to know, definitely leave me a comment below and ask me for a recommendation on a video. If you felt that this video helped you out today, definitely subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up. I appreciate all the support I can get and thank you for watching today. 
and I look forward to teaching you something new in the next video.